Hi and welcome to Keep Us Creative Flow. Welcome. Um, we are looking at hand lettering and ledger paper today. So the hand lettering is part of the Chung Journal January prompt, which is um, hosted by Meg Journals. And the ledger paper prompt was from the Defema Rembra um, by Louisa Heinzel and, and Barbara from 49 Dragonflies. So go check. I, I will link... Um, Louisa's process video down below as well because she just creates her own um, ledger paper and just doodles um, like it doesn't have it, it wasn't like actual writing she was just scribbling like it just appeared like um, writing so that's really cool so I'm definitely going to link her video let me just pop that there so what I've already started um, with hand lettering I will just do a quick, um, I'll show you like how, how I did it. I just got loads of, I've got loads of um, different colored. So I've got these manuscript um, italic, Italic creative. Um, it says made in the EU. So I don't know if you can get hold of these where you live. Um, so I've got all these in all different colors. The reason why I bought those is because these ones that I've had for absolutely years so, I've, so these were by calligraphy maker SY2410 sorry one SY2410 um, these have I've had these for, I would say over 15 years basically but and I'm I've, I'm only down to like four now of these but these were the best. There are two point, there are two point um, millimeter on one side and three point five millimeter on the other side. Um, I can't believe they lasted so long. So if I if I were to get a new set, I'd definitely go for these ones. And then I've got these ones that I used in the last one of the other videos were three pound ninety nine. Um, the really affordable art studio by art studio, and they sell them at the range. So if you're looking for those. Um, definitely really nice colours and yeah so you can basically you can use any pen I've even got this one from Tiger I've got a just a broad manuscript pen so it's not even got like a italic nib or anything so just use what you have really oh um, I already so he's thinking why is it white on there so I've already gessoed over this um, where's the gesso so it's this um, Studio Acrylics Gesso by Pebio. Um, I'm sure you can get it at any art store. And then, so I left this to dry overnight. So this is going to be our base. Um, and then I was thinking, let's use this um, packaging from the oranges. And I've still, I didn't even put this away from last time. I've still got the paint in my thing. So I've just... Squirted it with a bit of water. I think this was the ultramarine gouache colour by Art Advantage. Um, came in a pack. Um, so all I'm going to do is just um, draw a bit. Just go along the whole edge of this. Just go sideways. So I'm just dabbing. This is just a foam dauber. You can get it in the kids section. So just to give a bit of interest, I'm going to just. Oops. I quite like the bits which are um, frayed as well if you can get some of those in. Super right. I've got a wet wipe nearby <laughs> on standby. Just cleaning my hands. <laughs> Oops. And then so that's what that looks like. So I'm just gonna let Oh, before I carry on, one second. I've just got, um, I think this is the end of a tape. I don't, I'm not sure exactly what was on there. And so what I was thinking is using the brown and just making a mark. Making a few marks with it. blue is coming in as well which is fine let's get some more brown on so 
let's try and use the actual uh, distorber as well. There's no rules, just do whatever you feel. And behind I've got super thanks, huge thanks, um, thank you very much, ta, with thanks, thanks a million. Yeah, so I've got loads of thank yous as my writing behind. So what we're going to do, I'm just going to let that dry while we move on to the next bit. So I'm just going to clip this onto the radiator. Shh, don't tell no one. <laughs> It'll be fine. Right, so the other thing that we've got going on, so with the pen, first of all, I was thinking of using this as my, I'm going to put it on the front of that, um, actually I don't know where I'm going to put it, but I was thinking maybe we'll use this to write our main word of thanks on there. Uh, yeah, that'll be a centre point. Save that. I'm just going to use the paint to edge this, just to give it another border, it gives it another dimension. Hope you're doing all right. Put that down. So, um, I drew, so I had some of this scrap paper left over, which I was using for something else during the week. So what I've done, um, so it was just a plain piece of paper. So what I've done, I've used, um, this just to create the lines. It can be any red pen. You can use a red biro if you've got it. Just use a red biro. Yeah. Um, and then I'll use the pencil to create. So I use the ru I've got a ruler. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I've got a ruler and then just just did really fine lines. Um, so next, I was thinking we'll just put um date here. And then we'll put the number of whatever it, whatever page this is. So maybe we could put um, number four, possibly. Uh, I don't know what we're going to be ledgering about, but yeah. So I was just going to do some writing. So before we start on our main thanks and just writing on here i just thought let's just have a little scribble so if you've never done any um just play around really that's the advice i would give so um so with the thanks now this is a thick tip so this is all i was doing so i was just doing um different Styles. Yes, yeah, so I just do big writing, small writing, whatever you think will work. Um, there's no right or wrong. And if you get like, say for example, like the, that one, if you get um, one that doesn't work that great, um, you can just go over it again. Um, what color shall we do next? So you get the idea, or you could do like bubble writing, or um, what was I doing on the other one? Just different styles of writing, really, with lettering. 
we could go and it's really swirly with the tea. And the K. So you could go wild really. But you just have a practice, that's all I would say. But even with a pen. So yeah, so that, that is what I did before I gessoed that last night. Um, yes, yeah, so I hope you can have fun with that. So with this, all I'm going to do is do a bit of writing. Um, uh, I know what to put on there. So I'm writing um, date, immunisation, type and route. Let's have some creative licence and just do a swirl there. So we're going to fill this out. So we've got 14, 01, oh, 01's gone wonky, 22. And the key. Um, yeah, they can stick them anywhere, can't they? So, what <laughs> arm? And the immunizate. No, I don't know how to spell this, but is it like that? I think so. Don't know. Um. So gonna write something I think let's write something I've got something already planned in my head and let's let's do this <coughs> so we've got date 14th of Jan we've got um, the immunization which is Pfizer the type the injection and the root the arm so I'm gonna start writing now <laughs> I'm gonna ignore the um, border so actually should I write over two bit two lines Hmm. Yep, let's write over two lines. So within the mind. So I'm using it as a guide, you know, like we did at school. So I'm just using that second line as a guide. Um, within her mind, the throbbing, hmm, should have missed a line, doesn't matter, throbbing pain, continuing. Her eyes hurt and blue. Head felt heavy. She looked in the mirror She was shocked to 
It was true. She collapsed and fell. Everybody left differently. I understand. What about? Yep, so that's that. I'm just going to get the part that has been drying. Oh, still not dry. Darn. This is the trouble we're going to have, isn't it? Okay, I'm going to have to let that dry after. But my idea was to attach this to the back. I wonder if I could still do it. One second. Just got the U. HU glue roller. Just going to use that on the back of this. 
It just gives off little dots of glue. Oh, we will. It's good enough to hold. Might leave half a gap at the bottom actually. Okay, so I'm add in anything else in. So all I'm doing is carefully, carefully does it. Um, oh dear me. Get your tissue. I'm just going to make sure that's flattened down. We're going to have to just let that um, dry. But then for the middle of this, which I wanted to add in the middle, I wanted to say, wanted to put thank you, so let us use, let us use the blue one, the navy blue. And right, <laughs> I'm thinking about getting that all over me now. Let's do that way. Um, Oh no, it's the one that doesn't... <laughs> that one doesn't work as well. Let me see if I can go over it. Might go over it with a grey. Put the state on my hands as well. Gonna do a swirl. Don't know why I do them everywhere, but yeah. Snip it. Just thinking of where to put it. Yeah, I was thinking the centre first, but then I don't think it stands out for me. Mm. Yeah, I think there, because let's go over there, let's go over there. Probably don't need all that glue, but there we are. That's that. This needs going. You didn't stick it down properly, did you? You probably didn't put the glue there, though. No. Yeah, that's good. Oh no! <laughs> You're supposed to leave it open. I say I've, I, you know, what? I think one thing, and then I'm just like, I wanted to leave it open so I could slot something in there, but <sighs> silly, really. Never mind. Okie doke. So. That's that. Um, I was going to just add something in there as well. I'm going to use my finger. Sorry about this. I'm just going to, seeing as I've got paint anywhere, everywhere anyway. <laughs> what? <laughs> what do I use that? Fingerprint. Oh no, 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 no. Let's do a little bit. Rub it on, rub it off. That's the one. Oh god, I'm gonna have to wash my hands, Anna. So the hand lettering. Should we on that side or so this is more browny. Might actually add it here. Feels like you need something else. One second. So there was this which I was cutting out some circles by hand. So there's this bit as well. Which one should I use? You know 
know what you don't need that let's just stick it down buffing around executive decision we're gonna go for it stick that there i do think you need something else but i don't exactly know what quite like this um this frayed bit so i might leave it in i'll see i'll see what so that is our hand letter in the ledger paper um prompt i hope you enjoyed that um take care for now see you in the next one bye now